All right, ladies and gentlemen, this is probably going to be the final-ish episode of this Portal 2 playthrough with me, Get Bag the Great, and we've basically just gotten through a massive assault course of, well, Wheatley just trying to murder us, and now we've gotten through this area that's got a bunch of corrupted cores stored over there. We've got GLaDOS here in this little potato core here, and we're going to put her in this socket. What? I'm pretty sure it's a problem with the light. I think the light's on the blink, but just in case it isn't, I am actually going to have to kill you, um, as discussed earlier. So let's call that three minutes and then a minute break, but we should leave allegedly two minutes to figure out how to shut down whatever is starting all the fires. So anyway, that's the itinerary. Got it. Also, I took the liberty of watching the tapes of you killing her, and I'm not going to make the same mistakes. Four part plan is this one, no portal services. Two, start the neurotoxin immediately. Three, oh. proof shields for me. Needing directly onto number four, four, just by throwing it. You know what? This plan is so good, I'm going to give you a sporting chance and turn off the neurotoxin. I'm joking, of course. Goodbye. Neurotoxin level at capacity in five minutes. Oh, ah, oh, oh, ah! Okay, so I got a bit ah, of damage there. That's sounded real. No, that was actually an impression of you. Actually, because you just fell into my trap, my brilliant trap. Just then, okay. I wanted you. Ah! Okay. Glados, I need a corrupt support. Okay, so I need to stun Wheatley with those bombs. He'll chuck them at me. I need to throw them at him through portals. I need to use these cores that GLaDOS gives me and attach them to him to make him even more stupider. Yes! Oh! Okay. Ah, I didn't think about just putting the bombs underneath him. That was quite apt, actually. Okay. Great. Okay. What's the situation? Oh, hey, I am pretty late. My name's Rick. So are you out having yourself a little adventure? What are you fighting that guy? You got that under control? You know because like, there's a lot of stuff on fire. Wow, this guy's hey, actually hitting on Glados. That's actually that Situation's <laughs> quite funny. Such a beautiful. There you go. Morning. Core corruption at 75%. Okay, so Reactor maybe we just need to add on one more. Destroy. Reactor explosion uncertainty emergency preemption protocol initiated. This facility will self-destruct in two minutes. Oh, come on! I told you not to put these cores on, but you know this, dude. Quiet. Quiet. Quietly, not listening to a word I say. Judge. Ah! Okay, so we've stunned him again. One more core. Come on, let's do this. Right, R Glados, where is it? Where is it, sweetie? R Seriously, where is it? Where the fuck is it? Where is the core? Oh, there it is. Bloody hell. Okay. Okay, maybe if I... William Shakespeare did not exist. His plays were masterminded in 1589 by Francis Bacon. Okay, if I r go running into the blue portal, come Rickles. flying up through the orange one, I can fly up and grab Abraham it. There we go, got him. 
Like everything he did, Lincoln freed the slaves while sleepwalking. Come on, sleepwalking. stop, no Jesus Christ, life. shut up. Before okay. the invention of scrambled eggs in 1912. Go, yes, got it. At 100%. Yes! Ah. Manual core replacement required. Oh, I see. <laughs> Substitute core. Are you ready to start? Corrupted core. Are you ready to start? What do you think? Interpreting vague answer as yes. Stalemate detected. Right. Fire detected in the stalemate resolution annex. Extinguishing. Oh. Oh, it's literally oh, extinguishing the fires. Does it? Well, that would have been good to know a little earlier. Stalemate resolution associate. Please press the stalemate resolution button. Do not press that button. No! Do not do it! I forbid you to press it! Press it! Press the button! Don't press that button! Press it! Don't press it! Don't get in there anyway! Come I don't... back! Press the button! No! Oh, do not out. press that okay. button! Do not do it! Do not press it! Come back! Oh my! Booby trap the stalemate button! What? Are you still alive? You are joking! You have got to be kidding me! What? I'm still in control, and I have no idea how to fix this place. Oh, you had to play bloody cat and mouse, didn't you? While people were trying to work. Yeah, well now we're all going to pay the price, because we're all going to bloody die. Oh, brilliant. Yeah, take one more look at your precious human moon, because it cannot help you now. Oh my god, I have to fire a portal at the moon, don't I? Orange portal there, blue portal on the moon. Fuck it, let's go for it. Oh my god. Space! Oh, this is highly illogical and shouldn't really be possible. We're in space! Ah, let go! Let go! I'm still connected! I can pull myself in! I can still fix this! I already fixed it. And you are not coming back. Oh no! Change your plans! Hold on to me! Tighter! Ah! Grab me! Grab me! Grab me! Grab me! Grab me. Say an hour weekly. Oh my god. Oh, that was pretty hair-raising. Lunacy, yeah, that's a pretty good uh, name for that achievement. I'll be, I'll be honest. I wouldn't really expect anything else. Oh, those are the two robots Carol, from the card campaign. God, you're all right. You know, being Carolyn taught me a valuable lesson. I thought you were my greatest enemy, when all along you were my best friend. The surge of emotion that shot through me when I saved your life taught me an even more valuable lesson. Where Carolyn lives in my brain. Carolyn, delete. Goodbye, Carolyn. You know, deleting Carolyn just now taught me a valuable lesson. The best solution to a problem is usually the easiest one. And I'll be honest, killing you is hard. You know what my days used to be like? I just tested. Nobody murdered me, or put me in a potato, or fed me to birds. I had a pretty good life. And then you showed up, you dangerous, mute, lunatic. So you know what? You win. Just go. <laughs> it's been fun. Don't come back. Well, that's an awfully rude way to end our friendship, isn't it? It's not like I... well, I did kill her, but... I don't know. Oops, CGI cutscene, this must be important. They're not gonna shoot me. Oh, it's another song! Well, this video is probably going to get copyright claimed, that's for sure. Oh, there's all the deformed and crappy turrets as well. <laughs> well, 
that is a lot of turrets. Oh, there's a fat operator turret. Oh my god, look at that size of that turret in the background. <laughs> forgot how cool this ending segment was. Oh wow, that, that giant turret in the background is creating the base, that's awesome. The outside world. Huh. God, I wonder what must have been like to feel fresh air on your face for the first time after being inside for so long. Oh wow, it's the incinerated companion cube from the end of the first game. <laughs> As good as this song is, I do prefer the one at the end of the first game because it had a slightly better rhythm, even though the lyrics of this one are, you know, perhaps have more of that charming portal level, you know, dark comedy. But I, I don't know, I do like the one from the first game a bit more. It's a little bit more, slightly more memorable, but this one's still pretty good. Oh, does I see photo credit of NASA there? Wow. They actually worked with NASA on this game. Too much space. Need to see it all. I wish I could take it all back. I honestly do. I honestly do wish I could take it all back. And not just because I'm stranded in space. In space. I know who you are, mate. Yeah. You know what? I really appreciate someone doing some knocking next door on anyway, the fucking wall. You know, if I was ever to see her again, do you know what I'd say? In space. I'd say, I'm sorry. Sincerely. I am sorry I was bossy and monstrous. And... I am genuinely sorry. In this case. The end. Oh wow, they actually changed the main menu to that. Ha oh, ha, that's cool. Wow, what a game. And yeah, I'm definitely going to be playing the bonus maps. Random intervals in the future. I mean, as you guys will see at the beginning of this playlist, I have already done the co-op campaign with my friend Philip, aka Flash Suppressor. So we won't be doing that again, but... I think I do remember that there are some single player bonus maps on this game and I'm going to do those at some point in the future. But for the time being, that's it for this main playthrough of Portal 2. There will be, like I said, some bonus videos of me doing the other bonus maps in the future. So stay tuned for those. Next up for our next side playthrough, we've got the, uh, the um, in quotation, yeah, very ironic quotation marks, I Divine Cybermancy. So yeah, not exactly looking forward to that. If you've seen the reviews, you'll know why. But I hope you guys have enjoyed this playthrough as much as I did making it, even though it was testing and it got on my nerves sometimes. Uh, mainly just because of my sheer incompetency at completing some of the more complex uh, you know, puzzles and test chambers. So, you know, that's, that's kind of really to be expected with me. But I hope you guys did enjoy it overall and maybe found it somewhat informative. Probably not, to be honest, because I'm that crap at this game. But in any case, I hope you guys did enjoy it in general. And I really appreciate you guys staying tuned for the whole of this playthrough. As I did genuinely really enjoy making it. And yeah, leave a like, share and subscribe if you did enjoy it. Or at least found it somewhat informative. Check out my other social medias and YouTube channels in the video description below. And leave any comments down below if you want me to do any particular games. Or if you want to just see any general kind of gaming videos in the future as well. I've been Get Bag the Great. Have fun, stay safe, wash your hands, take care of your family. I'll see you guys next time on the battlefield. Bye-bye for now.